Hello. Now I'm going to be talking about aspects in BSL. I'll spell that for you. So this is the sign for it. I will explain what it means. Aspect means how you would do something over time. There are nine different ways of using aspect. Number one, it's called durative. So this means the verb, the sign for the verb is repeated to show how long you, you do that for. So for example, I waited to see the doctor for quite a while. Another example. I rang the doorbell for ages before someone came to the door. See if you can think of any examples yourself. Number two. This is called continuative aspect. So this means that, that you sign the verb, but that will show a long time, that you're doing it for a long time. So for example, I was waiting in traffic for a long time. Another example, I had to wait a long time to get my PIP letter. See again if you can think of any more examples yourself. Number three. It's called habitual aspect. So this uses the verb to show that you're doing it regularly. So for example, I regularly go to the deaf club. Another example, I always watch soaps on television. Number four, it's called iterative. So that's when you do that over and over again. So you use the verb to show that things are happening again and again. For example, I have to visit the client again and again. Another example, I have to go to the audiology at hospital again and again. See if you've got more examples. Number five is inceptive. So that means where you're interrupted. So it means the verb stops to show that something has stopped you doing it or you've been interrupted. So for example, I was eating my breakfast when the doorbell rang. Or another example, I was watching TV when my husband interrupted me. Number six, this is called cessive. So this means I'm about to start but I'm interrupted. So an example, I was about to eat my breakfast when the doorbell rang. Or another example, 
I was about to leave work when my boss called me. Number seven. Oh. This is called incremental aspect. So this is where you move a bit at a time. So for example, every month my pregnant tummy gets bigger and bigger. Or another example, my grandson every time I meet him is getting bigger and bigger. Number eight, this is called gradual aspect. So this means that the verb, the movement is much slower to show a gradual. So like for example, my business gradually expanded or my children grew up gradually. One more, number nine. This is called sudden aspect. So this is like a fast movement of the verb to show that something happens suddenly. So for example, my business suddenly expanded or my children seem to grow up so quickly so that means you have to try and remember in BSL features you've got the difference between timelines remember A, B, C, D and E the timelines so like these different timelines here but aspect shows how you would sign the verbs within the time so timelines are linked to units of times, like week, days, months. So I hope you understand the difference. If not, please come and ask me and I'll try and explain it again to you.